Oh my goodness. Oh, shoot. Oh, how in the hell has everybody been doing? I am bored. Bored, bored, bored. I had some time to myself. Just now, put some, I put some ice on my knee. And, um, I'm feeling nice and calm and peaceful after the events that have went down. Today is, what's today, Thursday? Yeah. It was a long week this week. Long week. I think the worst is over yet. I gotta have my trailer get sighted yet. Um, that's gonna have to happen. Um, but things are calming down. I got to be a bounty hunter. My niece Ashley was a bounty hunter with me last night. <laughs> I hated to do it, but, you know, this individual just has nowhere to go. You know, this person's built all their, burnt all their bridges, and that's, that's what happens. But, um, I can't, I, I, I can't make that person comfortable and take care of that he's a grown man. So, um, I pray for him. Um. I, I wish, you know, I, I feel like he's he's my son, you know. Our loved ones with addiction, you you love to hate them. It, it's hard to love them, you know, and it's hard not to try to fix everything for them. It's hard to watch your kids that are involved with them, too. Um, try to knock some sense into them and... It's, it's hard not to knock them in the head and say, what the hell are you thinking, you know? Don't do that, or, you know, you're so much older and you've been through it. You were there, you know, and what well, kind of? I mean, I never dealt with, I never dealt with, you know, in my marriage. He, he, he wasn't violent or, he never called me names. He never, you know, he never stole shit or, you know, he got no DUI, that's, about the worst he did, you know, but I, you know, so I can't really relate with other people that were involved with individuals who were drugging, you know, I, I guess, I don't know, my dad talked to me about that since I was, I don't know, a little kid and, you know, I, I always thought guys that did drugs or pot, it turned me off, like, I was just stereotyped them like, ooh, they're lazy or, ooh, they're kind of grody. But geez, if they drank a lot, boy, they were good to go. <laughs> I guess it's all in what you're raised with, you know. Um, I mean, it doesn't make them any better, you know. Just because they're a drinker doesn't make them any better than a druggie, you know. My eating disorder doesn't make me any better than a drug addict. Just because I have an eating disorder and I smoke cigarettes. It doesn't make me any better, you know. We're all, we're all in this together, you know. It's just so amazing. It's like when you figure this out, it feels like you're in a daze, you know, and you realize you sit and ponder and think and you meditate. It, like that, that Leslie guy, that's that actor, he said, I, I like that saying, meditating is listen to God. Praying is talking to God. Or the universe, whatever religion you might be. You know, some people... I'm putting this uh, stuff on that my sister Tammy Vondren gave me. It's I'm still recovering from a meniscus tear. Dr. Parati fixed my knee. It was the... I think that what I'm understanding is the meniscus is your cartilage between your kneecap and your... What is that? femur bone or I don't know the calf bone anyways that's I'm still recovering from that but um it's an all natural pain relieving gel works pretty good 
And then I was talking about my bidet thing. She sent me a thing on Facebook. I just noticed. I haven't. I just got my internet fixed today. I I only had 20 gigs when I had ordered 40 gigs. But I got to find the email and. That's another thing that I, I feel like I'm in an office trying to get all this stuff done. You know, it takes you all day to try to get a hold of the internet. To, oh, shit. She caught me. What the fuck are you talking about now? Oh, no. <laughs> she caught me again. God damn it. I'm doing a live thing and I think I can be freaking incognito. What are you talking about? Life. Like what? <laughs> not you. I'm not talking about you. It better not be. I'm not talking about you. Okay, well, I'm sitting in here monitoring. Oh, no. She's, yeah. mon no, no. She's monitoring me. Yep, I'm monitoring. Hello. Oh, oh, shoot. Now I lost my train of thought, you ass. That's what you get. Oh, we're just talking about life. I'm bored. Oh. You're live? No, I'm recording it. Oh. I tried to go live on YouTube, but it said I'm not, I'm not allowed to go live yet. I, I must not have enough viewers and likes, so I can't go live yet. Would you just start recording? No, I've been on here six minutes. Oh, but I was talking about a bidet, so Tammy Hatcher sent me Mother. a bidet. Mother! Mom! No. I'm literally going to duct tape your mouth. Stop talking about that on fucking... I'm buying one. Did you see that Tammy sent it to me? I'm buying one. I'm going to put it on my toilet. And it cleans you, and I don't have to worry about sanitizing. It cleans itself. You're still wiping, aren't you? Yes, I'm wiping, but it's like taking a shower every time you pee and poo. And you're so fresh when I get a boyfriend. Ah, I'm going to be fresh! I get a boyfriend. Woo I'm gonna get a good one too. I can't believe it. He gonna be a farmer. Oh boy. He gonna have dirty jeans. Yeah, he finished gonna... that thing for Mila. Did ya? Okay, I guess I'll I'll call quiz. Yeah. She ruined my talk. Your TED talk is over. My oh my TED talk. I love TED talk.